Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. It's been quite a while, way, way too long. YouTube actually sent me an email saying if I don't post, they're gonna demonetize me. That's not why I'm posting right now. I'm posting because I want to and because I love posting on YouTube. I just got this cool thing in the mail that I'm holding. Actually, I don't know if it's cool or not. I haven't tried it yet, but it's like a pillow for your bed. It kind of like covers that crack between the wall and the bed. And I don't have a headboard. I don't even really know if I want a headboard. I had one for a while and I just, I don't know. I just, there's not any headboard that I love enough to want. So I thought this would be a good compromise. So I'm gonna put it on my bed right now and show you if I like it and how it works. And I thought I would also do some like apartment kind of updates in this video and just catch up and maybe do some life updates. I don't know, does anyone care? on YouTube about my life. I feel like most people really just care about my apartment, which is pretty much all I care about too. I have my own home staging business. I'm an interior designer in San Diego. My staging business has kind of taken off. Like I was working alongside someone and ended up going my own way and starting my own business. And it's been doing really well. It's been keeping me really busy. That's why I haven't really been on YouTube so much, but um, my apartment is a disaster. It always is because I take stuff out of my apartment all the time and use it for staging. And so it's kind of like, I feel kind Kind of dumb like showing my apartment because it's really never that cute anymore but i'll still give you guys an update and i'm gonna put this thing on my bed right now I guess you have to give it enough time to like puff up with air. It's made out of memory foam and it has this little like pocket on the side for your phone. I'm gonna give this thing however long it needs to puff up. In the meantime, let me show you this blanket that I also ordered from Amazon that I think is extremely cute. Don't mind the Reese's over there on my coffee table. It's this chocolate brown checkerboard blanket. I'll put links for all this stuff in the description box below. I always do. But I thought this blanket would be really pretty with that mirror above my bed like i just really like the brown and the checkerboard to be honest with you i had a little bit of a weird smell when i got it out of the box Ugh, it still kind of smells a little weird so maybe i'll try to wash it i still really like it um i also this is actually huge major 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 news i decided on a dresser i spent like years of my adult life trying to decide on a dresser that I liked well enough to like spring the money for. So I ended up getting this dresser from Article. It's like very mid-century. It's incredible. I'm gonna insert some clips of me assembling it. I didn't pay extra for the assembly. I move furniture for work. Like that's my job is moving furniture <laughs> around. So I was like, I can probably assemble it myself. I would not recommend that. I probably could have broken it when I got it up on its legs and um, it just, I probably should have just paid to have someone else do it. Vertical has been awesome to like purchase from. I'm, I'm not affiliated with them in any way. Their customer service was really nice and they brought the dresser to my front door. They called me the day of and let me know what time they were going to be here. And they have this thing where if the dresser goes on sale within 30 days of you buying it, that they'll refund you the difference. And the dresser actually did go on sale and they actually did refund me the difference. So that's really cool. So yeah, here's the dresser.
Okay, now that some time has passed, it's been probably like an hour now. I think it's kind of puffed up, but you know what? I feel like since it's memory foam, it's gonna like squish down and I'm not gonna end up liking it, but I'm gonna go ahead and put it on and see how it makes my bed pillows look. I guess I'll try it out for tonight and see when I read in bed if it feels comfy or if it's not worth the price. I'll put the price on the screen right now because I don't remember how much it cost. Okay, it definitely makes my pillows stand more forward, but I have a feeling I'm gonna absolutely hate being able to see that thing. I mean, I guess I could like move my pillows over a little bit. I guess I could do that. Ugh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Anyway, now that I've shown y'all my new dresser, let me just show you what it's looking like now. I got this really cute lamp at Home Goods. The chair is from, I think, Wayfair. But yeah, here's my beautiful dresser, styled. Yeah, I'm obsessed with it. I really haven't used it much. I haven't like put anything in the drawers yet. I really need to like actually start utilizing it. Hello everyone, it's the next day now. I've officially decided I'm returning this blanket. It smells so weird. Like, it's so cute. Like, the brown checkerboard, I just dropped it on the ground. I don't even care. It's just like, it's just, why does it smell like that? Anyway, my hair is an absolute grease pit. I am going to change out my bedding. And this is like a huge big deal because I have an Amazon versus Target lemon bedding video on my channel that did really surprisingly well. I still have my same Target bedding and my same Target sheets. I love them. I love my bedding. Oh my gosh. Like, oh, I want to get in my bed right now. <laughs> this brand called Quince sent me some linen sheets to try out. They're not paying me to talk about it. And so I'm going to finally wash them. They probably maybe hate me because they sent me these sheets like several months ago. And I obviously haven't posted anything on my YouTube channel and like months and months and I have just been busy working. The time has come, the day has come. I'm gonna wash these sheets and I'm just gonna see how they compare to my Target ones. I have no complaints about my Target ones. I'm not swapping out my duvet cover or my insert. All that's from Target. I'll link everything and I'll link that video if you care. I'm just gonna try these sheets and see how they are. look really nice really nice this is like actual linen okay and here's the sheets that i have now these i think have a little bit of a cotton blend i'm pretty sure but these look really nice so i'm gonna put them in the washer right now and um get them all washed up the ones that i have from target these my original sheets are the hearth and hand collection and the color is called sour cream so they're like a little bit of an off-white and these are like more of a stark white and i'm really excited for that <gasps> look at that beautiful fabric i'm such a nerd okay let me get these washed Side note, just as I was laying my little tripod down, I saw this candle setting on my dresser and thought I would share. This is one of the more inexpensive candles from Target. Like one of the cheaper ones, Jasmine and however you say that. It smells just delightful. Like last night I had it lit and I was like, wow, I keep smelling something that smells so wonderful. Just so lovely and faint. And I forgot that I had my candle lit, but oh my gosh, it smells incredible. It smells like this Sonia Kashuk perfume that I used to wear that got discontinued. I think about that perfume like every day of my life and this candle kind of smells like it so it's wonderful i highly recommend by the way another side note and maybe it's pointless that i even filmed myself unpackaging this pillow in the first place but i've officially decided that i'm returning this i think maybe i haven't decided like the memory film has actually like molded to the, to my bed pretty well okay let me not make that decision yet let me let me give it a little more time
they feel so airy and light and like so nice and i love that you can see the linen texture i just think linen is just so pretty so that is the one difference that i feel between these and the hearth and hand magnolia ones that i had is these just feel very floaty like very light like they feel very luxurious and my hearth and hand ones feel just a little bit heavier so i think these will be really nice um i'm sure the wrinkles will fall out there's no way in hell that i will be steaming or ironing ironing my sheets that is for sure i'm gonna get my duvet cover on and make up the bed and actually what i decided i'm gonna do is get my room really nice and cleaned up and i'm gonna give you guys an evening bedroom tour because my bedroom is like so vibey at night like i have my red light bulbs and i light my candles i'm gonna have it all nice and clean with fresh sheets i'm gonna work on cleaning it up a little bit right now it's not really done like my bedroom never really feels totally done like, there's obviously always probably gonna be things that i want to change about it or things i want to like update or like add to but um, I can at least show you what it looks like now. It's probably as good as it's going to get for a while. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do that. I officially decided I'm not keeping the bed pillow. So I have that and the stinky blanket boxed up. And I'm on my way out the door to return these things at the UPS store. to you with this sleepy scratchy voice in the kindle under my pillow i just wanted to give a quick update on these sheets before i end this video they're really lovely i really like them my one complaint is that they're not extremely soft but i know that linen just from experience with my last sheets and with this duvet cover it gets so much softer as you wash it i felt like they were very temperature regulating i woke up feeling like it was in a cloud so i would say i highly recommend especially for the price love white sheets it just feels like luxury hotel vibes to me but they have a lot of other colors so anyway you can make your own decision i'll have the link below if you want to check them out they've been really nice and really cool and you know that's something i really appreciate in a company nowadays is like their coolness and their niceness anyway Here's my bedroom in the light. I do plan on actually posting more YouTube videos from here on out. And I think I'm gonna incorporate some of my home staging and interior design content. Thanks so much for watching, especially if you're still here watching my channel after 10 months of me not posting. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.